someone's garden. It may be yours. And along the lane comes a familiar figure, or at least a familiar voice. Good afternoon. How's it going? Ah, that sounds like Mr. Middleton. Yes, it is the Mr. Middleton, friend of all gardeners. And Pathé Pictorial brings him into your garden to give a little helpful advice. He explains that the right-handed way of digging is to put your left foot on the spade with the handle at the right side of your body. Well, we won't argue about it. The main thing is to use the spade. And I see you've been using yours to pretty good effect here. I like the look of your garden. It looks businesslike. I see you've cleared up all your early peas and other summer crops and got it nicely laid out with winter greens, stuff for the winter. You know, we hear a lot of so-called witty remarks about the poor old humble cabbage, but how we should miss it if we hadn't got it. And your potatoes too, they look well. As a matter of fact, your garden is a garden full of good food. That's what I like to see. And I wonder whether you ever realize when you're growing these vegetables that they've all been developed from wild plants, from absolute weeds of the forest by gardeners of the past. I like to think of that sometimes and take this opportunity of paying a tribute to gardeners and the wonderful work they've done. It's just the same with all your lovely flowers which are showing up so well today. None of them, I should think, as far as I can see, are English flowers. They've been brought into your garden from every corner of the earth. Well, I congratulate you on it. The garden's looking remarkably nice. Well, I mustn't hinder you any longer. Not at all. It's been a pleasure. Good afternoon, Mr. Good afternoon. 